Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is Greco298 and today I'm going to show y'all how to uh, edit Generation Zero uh, items and other th uh, things such as that. So here we go. We're going to come over to my uh, GitHub page. It's github.com slash Krako298. Come over to repositories. Go down to this repository. It should be updated sometime today or tomorrow. Uh, with even more stuff. But here we go. So this um, uses some of the item IDs or weapon IDs from the Generation Zero Save Editor or Gen Z Save Editor. Alright, so here we go. So first, I'm going to edit my weapon rarity in the game. Uh, let me go ahead and check. Let me just uh, go ahead and mute that real quick. And you know what? Let me uh, bring up the Valium. There we go. So then y'all can hear it. loading up right now I'm gonna click continue wrong button whoops I'm gonna click uh, hold tab Let's see which ones I have so I have a uh, PVG that I'm gonna be changing from a six star to a two star PVG and uh, then we're going to change it back and then we're going to edit the 51 of these to be uh, maybe something higher or something lower so let's exit to desktop wait for it to load my desktop sorry OBS is uh, terrible right now so first what I want to do is I'm going to scroll down to weapon ID I'm going to look up for the Puffsker 90 or PVG 90, and I'm going to look for the six star item ID. I'm going to copy this. I'm going to come over here to my uh, new, let me just open up a new window, and I'm going to come over here to, not this, whoops, sorry. Let's go this PC, Documents, Avalanche Studios, Saves, your, um, ID, Steam ID. Let's delete this. Then I'm just going to create a copy of this and paste it into this directory. And just name it something. Uh, on, for this tutorial, I'm going to name it savegame.backup and just hit the enter button. All right, now let me copy my item ID one more time. That should be awesome. Awesome, awesome. So I'm going to open up HXD now. You should have a window that just opens up. I'm going to take my save game, just drag and drop. And now I'm going to full screen it for y'all. So I'm going to click Control F. And I'm going to go over to integer number. All. I'm going to paste in the item ID and click search all. You should have a few things that pop up right here. This one is your hand right now, so this would be the uh, kind of like the look of the item. And then this is the actual item in your inventory. So what we can do is we can come over here to this item ID. We can see it over here. These two are the same. And then we can come over to here. These two are the same. It's always at a different address. One time it might be at um, 16 AC. Offset 16AC. Next offset, it'll be at 1BB4 or 1BBC or something like that. Let's go back and let's copy a new item ID. Uh, I always like the two star. It's a lot easier for um for you to paste it in or whatever because this is not valid INT32 or integer 32 number, but this is. So I'm just going to copy that. I'm going to go back to HXD. Uh, double click the uh, first one, which is from 0 to 400, or ugh, not 0 to 400, 0 to 1000. 
and just double click the integer 32 value, click enter, then come over here to this one, the 16 AC. It's never bigger than 2000 for your inventory, by the way. Come over to integer 32, paste it in, click enter. Then I'm gonna go over to file, save all, or you can click control S. Let's start up, uh, you know what, let's not start up generation zero quite yet. Now let's go ahead and uh, edit the uh, amount of uh, health packs, advanced health packs that I have. So first aid packs, advanced first aid pack, I'm going to copy the ID of that. I'm going to come back to HXD, control F, going to paste in this new integer number, search all, you should get a few of these. Uh, you won't actually uh, need this one right here. This is just some random data. Remember, anything in your inventory is never big than two, bigger than 2,000. This right here is your inventory. This right here is what's in your hand right now. That's the PVG, as you can tell. Right here is the PVG. Okay, yeah, right there is the PVG. And here's the item, or what do you, whatever you want to call it. Uh advanced uh, first aid kit we're gonna come back over and just or wait whoop, 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 whoop. so we don't need to edit this one we need to edit the amount of them so we aren't gonna edit the item ID but we're gonna edit this byte right next to it so the item ID is here then the amount is right here I have 51 so I'm gonna change that to uh, 62 click out of it and then go back and make sure it did that yep click control s or you can go up here and click save all now let's open up generation zero and see how it works or see if it did work it takes all it always takes a little bit to start up Any second now will be wonderful. <clears throat> All right, awesome. So let's check to make sure that I have the correct ID. Yep, so it's a two star. That is correct. Nothing else has changed as you can see. The, I still have the five star. I still have the same amount of ammo. And I have edited um, the amount of... Uh, amount of health packs so if I were to yep works perfectly yep alrighty if y'all like this video make sure to like it if you don't well then don't and I'll see y'all hopefully or maybe not in my next video Bye-bye.